Hey, it's Tom Gallagher, the video Videopreneur. We're at Bill Thomas Camper. We're looking at a 2023, well, we're looking at the American flag right there, 2023 27 FB Queen International. The inside is amazing. So I'm not gonna spend much time outside, it's cold, but I wanna get on the inside and show you all the goodies. It does have a rear door, unfortunately. There are items stacked in front of it. Let's get in out of the noise and the cold. It has these items stacked in front of it, but that door opens up and it has a screen that you can close so you can really let some air in. So this is the front uh, propane bottle covers. And then here is all kinds of uh, uh, stuff that comes with your Airstream. You can check out the floor. I haven't seen a floor like this before in a 2023. I haven't seen, I don't believe I've seen this uh, this blue leather either, very attractive. And as I mentioned outside, but in case you couldn't hear it, it is a 2023 27 FB Queen. And I'll show you the queen bed in a moment. And it is an international. So we have your deep stainless steel sink, really attractive uh, faucet. And then also the spray head. Plenty of cabinets and deep cabinets at that. And I always talk about the fit and finish in a Airstream. And I always show the uh, caddy, but boy, they know how to, in my opinion, really bring it. Three burner cooktop. We've got the uh, fan and then an the LED light. Plenty of light. You can see it really splashes on that three burner cooktop. Nice size oven, and I really uh, am excited to show you something else here in a second. So here's a great place to put canned goods and boxes, pancake mix, but check this out. Microwave oven, very impressive. Nice deep cabinet here. So we have the flat screen TV. I really like these lights here. And then you've got your privacy. Uh, my fingers are cold and I don't want to break anything, but uh, that closes up as well. And then you have your shades here. Really nice hardware on the Airstream. They really uh, know how to bring it, as I mentioned earlier. You have your refrigerator freezer. I like the uh, deeper part in the freezer. And uh, in case I haven't said it clearly enough or you haven't seen it, what I really like about that is if you have a power outage or you get to your destination or you get home and you uh, forget something in the freezer and it thaws out, it's going to pool in there and not make a big mess. I want to show you these cabinets here. Great place as far as uh, storage let me see if i can make a light here and then these are for your table for your dining area let me turn that off that's for your dining area you've got your hang-up clothes you got storage above your tabletop so right now it's down in the sleeping position or sleeping mode but that's where those uh poles go Really like the finish here, kind of a uh, like a marine finish like you would see in a boat. And then this is your bathroom with your commode, your sink, plenty of cabinet space. Then you have your medicine cabinet here and it's probably eight inches deep that way. Now it does curve with the outside of the uh, RV, so you do lose some space. And then you have your, ah, my fingertips are so cold. There we go. So you have the cabinet space there, top and bottom. 
And then across the hall is your shower, your shower wand, and then a bench if you want to just sit down and let the hot water run on you. Now check this out. We got a queen size bed, and then this is a drop down door. And let me get my hand out of there. I'll put on a light. So you got plenty of additional storage here. Flat screen TV. You got cabinets on both sides of the bed. And then check this out. This is the first time I've seen one, but you have the bunk bed above. Let me uh, hit my light. So you have that bunk bed. I'd love to hear in the comments below if you've seen one, if you have had one, and the usage. Personally, uh, you know, I don't know that I'd want anybody sleeping above me. Uh, when they go to get down, they're going to have to climb down and climb on you. And I know that if I'm with my wife and uh, I don't really want one of my kids or grand, I don't have grandkids yet, but one of these days I might. So that application seems a little foreign to me. Love to hear, you, hear from you in the uh, comment section. Thanks again for watching. Really appreciate the support. I enjoy bringing these videos to you. And I'm going to turn around and shotgun it one more time down the RV. So again, International uh, 2023 International 27 FB Queen. Thanks again for watching, and we'll catch you on the next video.